In this video, we are going to talk about water dew point calculation. Why it's important? Because the efficiency of the hydration facility is the water dew point of the dry gas. So, if we know, want to determine the efficiency of the hydration facility, we need to calculate the water dew point. Okay? The, this calculation could be easily done. Okay? But before, we need to make sure that the water stream that we are going to test is free from glycols, okay? So, the water that we are going to test, we need to make sure that the glycol isn't, doesn't exist, okay? Because the glycol can affect the dew point temperature, okay? So, to do this, to separate water from glycols or to make sure that there is no glycols, it's easy to be done. We can use something called a component splitter unit operation okay and after that we can analyze uh, the stream okay so here we are going to press f4 okay f4 to open the model palette and we are going to look for something called component splitter okay this one as a beginning first one this is called a component splitter and we are going to add it here okay it's a little crowded so it will not be added okay here we are going to take it and put it here okay this is our uh, component splitter double click and this will have uh, will open this is our splitter splitter okay the splitter the or to remove okay to remove teg okay this is the same okay for the inlet stream we are going to remove it from sales gas okay why because your sales gas is the gas that you are going to sell so you need to make uh, or to meet as some specs okay so for the sales gas we need to make sure that we have no tg okay the overhead will be your tg only okay so this stream will be TEG only you have in this stream only TEG okay and for the bottom product you have sales gas your sales gas with no TEG okay so this one that you can test the dew point for it okay the energy is the energy that okay so we need an energy stream here the energy stream will be uh, maybe a split Q okay so this is your in and out okay we don't know the splits so in this case we are going to parameters for the parameters TEG only stream temperature okay the temperature for TEG only is 30 degree Celsius and for the uh, sales gas will be the same temperature okay the pressure design we are going to equalize all stream pressures okay so here we can equalize all the stream pressures instead of calculating the pressure for everyone okay for we don't have the split so now we need to add uh, the composition okay for the splits we know that the stream teg only is only glycols okay so teg only is only 100 percent like okay for the stream teg only all other components will be zero okay so this one should be zero and zero zero we will keep adding some zeros here now we know what we have done okay after pressing okay uh, enter for the one it would be totally converged what does this mean which means you need to add all the composition of TG in this section and this one will have nothing which means the sales gas this composition will be transferred totally for your sales gas okay so now we have this one after that we need we add this actually the, this uh, component splitter to have at the end of the day your sales gas and for this sales gas you need to do the water dew point calculator okay how to do this okay we can double click here and this page will be open 
it has the conditions the properties okay for the properties here you have some a lot of properties actually you can add now uh, the water dew point we don't have it here so we are going to add it from this uh, plus okay you can add your property okay for um, after adding this one we are going to add a composition a gas because we have here gas we don't have a black oil we don't have electrolyte okay so we need to close this one we have a gas and for the gas we need to add a water dew point okay so after that you are going to apply it okay to the sales gas here so okay apply so now we if we get back it should be applied here okay if you scroll down you will find as the properties you have this one that you added water dew point of the gas a bit uh, calculated in degrees less is negative 9.8 so this is the dew point uh, that you are asking to calculate this is important to know how to calculate the dew point because in most exams you are asked to calculate it so it's easy done you just open the stream go to the properties you add it because it's a gas you will find it in a gas and water dew point and apply that's it okay so now we have finished our um, gas dehydration uh, simulation but this one is for a user uh, actually I mentioned two or three questions related to the expert but in the, our next video we are uh, going to discuss uh, this case as um, an expert okay uh, but before we need to make sure that you understand this whole simulation now okay so as a beginning here you have your inlet gas and this gas doesn't have water so you add to saturate it with water so we had here a, a saturator and now we have our wet gas our wet gas will be fed from the bottom to an absorber and the TEG will be fed from the top okay here is absorption happen or the contact happen and here we are going to have our dry gas with no uh, water vapor and for this one we are going to have our rich TEG which means this has a water vapor after that we lower the pressure by entering the valve and after that we increase the temperature because this regeneration prefer the temperature to be high and the pressure to be low okay so our regeneration feed enter here and from the bottom we got here this is our lean or regenerate okay we here take the, tem the temperature and we lower it okay and here we mix it with a makeup this makeup is important okay so before it was this value was negative but after finishing all the calculation now it's positive and if you open the mixer it's okay okay this makeup to make sure that any losses that happen during the regeneration will be re-added okay so after that they are mixed together and this feed will be pumped cold again and recycled to be teg feed okay this section we add this important for the dew point if you are asked about the dew point you need as a begin to make sure your cell the gas or gas is free from teg so you add a component splitter to remove the TEG and here you have your sales gas and to add the dew point you just double click and from the properties you add another property which is water dew point and it will be calculated okay let's talk uh, in our next video about how to um, understand the dehydration using Aspen Heises as an expert